to kind of yell. <laughs> okay, I'm definitely going to have to project my voice. I don't have a mic off of my camera right now. <laughs> so I'm going to yell just a little bit. But welcome! Doo -doo. Inserts edit. In this video, I just want to give you guys a brief introduction to me. So I found some questions like, oh, get to know this person type questions. And I'm just going to answer, I don't know, maybe like 20 of them. And then I just kind of want to talk about my goal for this channel. My goals for this channel. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. Good stuff. Leave a comment, please. I'm trying to grow my channel. <laughs> I greatly appreciate it. So Okay, so I have some questions for me. First one, my favorite dessert. I think my favorite dessert is banana pudding. I love banana pudding. Like, my favorite cake is carrot cake, though. I, I love carrot cake with the cream cheese frosting. Ooh. What cheers you up? Music. Dogs or cats? Dogs. A thousand percent. I'm sorry, cats. I, it's your dream holiday? I'm gonna take that as favorite. My favorite holiday, I'd say, is Christmas. I love Christmas time. Winter is my favorite season, which is probably going to be a question on here, so now you know. I love the holidays. I love Christmas time. I love putting the tree up. I love decorating the house. Um, how many kids do you want? I want, in my head, I want four. Um, <laughs> in this, like, parallel universe. I don't want four kids. I feel like in reality, I'll probably have one and be like, I'm never doing that again. And I'll probably end up with one child. But I would love four kids. There's just something about having my big black Escalade packed with children. It makes me feel fuzzy inside. <laughs> dream job. My dream job is to be a truck driver. I love driving. I love trucks. Do I believe in aliens? I'll say this. I don't think the entire universe is universing and humans are like the only ones out here. Favorite sport? My favorite sport to play is tennis. I started playing tennis sometime my senior year of high school and it was so fun. The sport that I ever played where I wasn't like, I hate this. I really enjoyed playing tennis. I like watching tennis too. Tennis is just top tier. And then I fell in love with Serena after that, after that point. My zodiac sign. I'm a Libra. Last song I listened to. I love sharing my music. That's not fun. Last song I listened to was Redbone by Childish Gambino. I was playing bass. I was playing bass last night. That's not what I expected. I thought it was going to be something by the internet. Okay. Well, I mean, it's fun. I, I love Childish Gambino. Don't get me wrong. How many tattoos slash piercings do I have? I'm glad you asked. I have... Um, my ears are pierced down at the bottom. That's it. My nose was double pierced like a month ago. I'm going to insert a picture. I mourn. <laughs> I mourn my double nose piercing. But I really loved loved that piercing like I thought it was so effing cute I'm really sad it's gone favorite movie but I know one of my favorite movies off the top of my head for sure is the last holiday with Queen Latifah and LL Cool J that is just such a good movie like it has a good ending it's funny it's lighthearted. I love Queen Latifah I love LL it's a good time um favorite song oh, and I get I get in these like song moods right now I'm really jamming out to Snow Allegra like period special affair Hold on by the internet. I'm still bopping to the the gift, the Black is King, the gift album. My relationship with my parents. That's a kind of a weird um my father passed away a year and four months ago. But we had a great relationship. Um and then me and my mom were like this. Like y'all are gonna beat my mom. You're gonna love my mom. I love my mom. <laughs> Three habits I have. I do wanna address this because I have a really bad habit. One is I make this weird <coughs> noise um when i was a little kid um i was around one of my cousins a lot and he made that noise and i just started making it it's a habit i don't even hear myself make the noise most of the time i notice it after the fact and i'm uh, after the fact and i'm like am i okay my pets i kind of don't have any pets <laughs> my roommates and my roommate has a yorkie kind of mine kind of not my future goals my future goals, and I'm gonna just address my goals for the for this channel. Um, my big slogan, my big um, I don't know what to call it, the big gist is to uplift Black women. I have a lot of things to say that'll be perceived the right way, 
uh, I feel like it'll be delivered the right way too. From naturally, I have a bias because I'm a black female, um, but I feel like from a more unbiased standpoint within itself, if that makes sense. I'm willing to sit back and say, you know, a lot of the problems, you know, black people face, you know, we have to address first within ourselves, within our household. Um, and that's something a lot of people won't admit to. So just starting there, taking responsibility is where it starts. Black people, we have to realize we gotta realize we the shit, we the shit, period. Celebrity crushes. Okay. Oh, I almost fell. <laughs> my camera shut off on me in my last video. Take three. But yeah, I have a list of like 52 people, but it's okay. I don't have a type, it's all over the place. Mind your business. Well, Adele, love her. Well, before she went in Bantu knots. I don't know how, I, we'll talk about that some other time. Brock O'Hearn. Oh, 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 that, um, that Tyler Perry movie. Oh, Boo 2? Was it Boo 2? Yeah, he, I think he was horse or something like that. <laughs> he was just fine. Uh, Bill Clinton, JFK, again, don't judge me. Um, Vanessa Williams, Patrick Dempsey, come on, you can't blame me for that one. Eric Dane, again, can't blame me. Matthew Morrison, I, Matthew Morrison um, was Mr. Shoe from Glee. Sarah Paulson, um, American Horror Story. She has some new show on Netflix too. Vera Farmiga. Um, Lorraine and like all those people. The Conjuring, it's The Conjuring. In The Conjuring series, she was Nor Norma Bates in Bates Motel. Oh, love her. Jesse Williams, of course, from, I've, I think I first, no, I saw him with some other stuff, but from Grey's Anatomy is probably what he's mostly known for. Tom Scavo, what is Doug Savant, I think is his real name. He was from Desperate Housewives. Mike Delfino, he's from Desperate Housewives. Ooh, Alyssa Milano, love her. Well, kinda. See, everybody, everybody fine, but then their 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 political views be contradicting me, contradicting me. Boris Kojo. Oh, Shamar Moore. That was like my first little. <laughs> um, Yemi. I never said her last name right. Yemi Al Yemi Alade. Please correct me if I'm wrong. I don't want to offend anyone. But Mama Africa, she is beautiful. Serena. I love Serena. <gasps> Rosalind Sanchez. If you don't know who Rosalind Sanchez is, throw yourself away. Oh, Jeffrey Dean Morgan. I forgot about him. Lion Babe. She's like a part of a singing group, but she's actually Vanessa Williams' daughter, if y'all ain't know. It goes on and on and on. Jill Scott, Erica Badu. I I've always loved Jill Scott, but I recently had this really weird, like, I'm in love with Jill Scott phase go on. And I'm not, I'm not mad at it. Something I fantasize about, a big black extra long Escalade with a red velvet interior. Ooh, no fantasy is better than that. <laughs> Things that annoy me easily. I'm, I'm a very short tempered person. So I, I'd like to elaborate on this. When people are rude, like at a restaurant, like, so people, people always like kind of stand offish to like wait staff and stuff. I don't like that. Nothing that annoys me if you don't put the money in the cashier's hand. Acting like you own the world, acting entitled. You know who you are. That's pretty much it for this video. So again, I hope you guys like me. I hope you guys like this video. You guys feel inclined to subscribe. And um, this isn't my room at my mom's place, not at mine. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and again thumbs up please like subscribe i have a lot of fun content coming what do i have coming you may ask or do you have some weight loss tips i lost uh i'd say about 60 pounds um my senior year of high school i have some vlogs coming up i am taking that trip for my birthday and i'm really i'm really excited about I'm working on cleaning out my house which is a mess and that's going to be a series of vlogs because the house is so big and stuffed with stuff um so that's gonna be really fun um, music i do have music coming i'm working on some music um to myself i have a whole bunch of stuff i want um to come out of this channel i have such a nice vision for it i eventually want to have a podcast going the whole nine please please give your support share like do what you got to do with all your friends please you know i'm gonna have time to edit and upload this but <laughs> yes so again, thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time.